Hi, I'm Chase Milky, author, speaker, educator, and expert on teacher well-being. Look, if there's one thing we know, it is that teaching right now is really, really challenging. And so how do we provide quality professional development so teachers can be at their best in order to give their best to the students who need them? My focus for the last year has been providing virtual professional development that is just as engaging, humorous, insightful, and research-based as doing it live. And I wanna share with you just a brief sample, a taste of what that professional development could look like to help your teachers, your staff, your caring adults be at their best so they can give their best. So how do we lose that purpose? How do we lose that spark that ignites our desire to help others? My wife's a second grade teacher. Every day when we come home from work, we just start emptying our pockets, all the junk that we have collected throughout our entire day. And out from her pocket, she pulls a human tooth. Now in a split second, I freak out. And all I'm thinking is, how weird is it that a teacher can come home with a human tooth? But it's more than just the tangible junk that we come home with, the teeth and the paper clips and the post-it notes. It is the emotional junk as well. Are you an emotional hoarder? Do you bring home everything you experience in your day? Every frustration, every failure, every freak out, every moment that doesn't go your way. While you drop in your number, I'm gonna expose you to my greatest dad wedding moves. Here we go. She threw every swear word at the book at me and she stormed out of the room. And again, the moment was uncomfortable. But remember that moments are unique. Moments come to an end and therefore moments have value. Human lives are unique. Human lives come to an end. Human lives have to see their value. All the notes said, four words. It will get better. She looks up and she starts sobbing herself. She's crying. And my students also go into freak out mode. They're like, oh my gosh, we've done something wrong. We've offended her. They rush up to apologize. And as they rush up to the lady, she simply holds out her arms to give them a hug. Now, I cannot guarantee that you're not going to have stress and challenges in the months and weeks and potentially hours ahead of you. But what I can guarantee is that you have everything within you to not just survive those challenges, but thrive. We give our best when we're at our best. Cheers to taking care of yourself so you can serve the people who need you most.